Alright guys, so we're starting the second day of Parasite Eve 2. So we're just gonna go through a big block of text here, so I'll just let you read it. If I go too fast, I'm sorry, just pause the video. And I'll also summarize at the end. Time to do that. All right. So it's the day after everyone got set on fire. <laughs> Doors can be kind of stay out of there. So we need to get a better weapon. So this is the uh, weapons room in the police station. My inventory is pretty full right now. Oh, a tool. Those are pretty useful, but they're kind of complicated, so we'll discuss how to use those in a little bit after this. Shotgun, rocket launcher. Oh boy. So, inventory management is a pretty big part of this game, especially in the later uh, areas. Sometimes, the game's really weird with discarding keys, like Resident Evil, you know, if you use a key, you can discard it. This game is really sketch about it. Sometimes it'll let you discard keys, sometimes it won't. Uh, it's just really weird. So, I still had the keys from last night, so I had to drop them off. And he gives me the M16A1. You can play a lot of the game with this gun. Um, we're going to put it on the M16. Now what he did, he gave me a mod permit, which allows me to add a slot for a modifier. So like, if I wanted to, I don't know, add like... Like poison rounds to the weapon, I could, you know, do that if I had a poison slot on a different weapon. I had, it just, all I did was give him an extra slot. And he's gonna explain how to use tools, which are much more, much, much more, um, useful than adding slots. Oh, that's a really horrible. <laughs> A really horrible tutorial. I'll do my own because I have a weapon I want to use one on. Okay. If you go down here to use tool, we're gonna pick the two weapons we're gonna use it with. So if you notice, on this weapon it has. The attack, the range, the bullets, and then to the right of that it says the base, and then plus. 
Well, those stats, and if you notice, if you add the plus to the base, you get what it what it is. So if you add one, the attack plus is one, attack base is 34, so you, the attack is 35. It's pretty self-explanatory. But you can transfer those pluses to any other weapon. So if you look down here at this gun, this has a 5, 2, and a 1 plus. So I can transfer those stats to any other weapon. The only thing though is if you're using a tool, then the the item or the weapon you're transferring stats to or from rather gets destroyed. So the M1911 is the weapon I was using uh, last chapter, and it has all these plus stats. I'm going to move them to the M16. And see, it's saying the M1911 will be lost. So if you notice right there, my attack on the M16 is 35. Now it's 40, because I moved those stats over. I lost the gun, but I gained five attack on this on this weapon. So pretty useful, pretty useful. Uh, you could, like I said, you can go through the whole game with that M16 just because you just keep adding stats to it, and maybe not the whole game, but. I usually keep it for a really long time. The game's getting a little laggy, and it's usually only when there's more than one character on the screen for some reason. So we'll just deal with it until we get back on the world map, because it's not that long from now. And that whole thing with tools, you can do it with, with weapons too. See, armor has plus stats. And, uh... Later on, there'll be. You can transfer more than stats. You can transfer little status effect things that they have. So now that we have a weapon, we can continue the story. See, down there, there's Ben, so we're gonna go talk to him. I just thought of a good. Uh, I just noticed. I saw the recording. I noticed I had. Uh, this armor too. See, if you see the little auto, that's an auto healing function. It means it automatically uses the potion whenever my life gets low. Um, but it's not the strongest armor that I have, so I'm not going to use it. But if I had another tool, I could transfer that into the armor I'm currently using. That's another way you can use it. Let's get on with the story because I've been talking to a lot about tools. It's starting to sound like a tool. I have a pretty decent video card. My processor's getting a little outdated. 